In this unit, I will introduce fractions to my third grade class. It will consist of 45 to 60 minute sessions over a two week period. There are four unit objectives covered throughout this unit. I will teach my students what fractions are and how they look. Using numbers and visuals. I will show real life examples of fractions and how we use them in our everyday lives. Like pizza. and apples, and even the sandwiches that are packed in students' lunches. I will teach students how to identify and understand the numerator and denominator of fractions, as well as teach my students how to understand and to compare fractions that are greater than, less than, or equal to. During this unit I will show three Mr. R videos from YouTube that incorporate song and pictures to teach students the concept of fractions, the numerator and denominator, and greater than, less than, or equal to. The following is an example of one of the videos. I know they're equal pieces, they're parts of a pie. Fractions, fractions, they're all right. Half a pie, half a tree. Halves of different things are different sizes, you see. But a half is a half, big or small. It takes two halves to make one whole. Fractions are equal sized parts of a whole. When it comes to halves, there are two equal sized parts that make up one whole. Now try to say these fractions. One half. Fractions, fractions, they're parts of a whole. Fractions, fractions, they're what I know. They're equal pieces, they're parts of a square. Fractions, fractions, they're right here. Tells how many. In this unit, we will have two fun fraction interactive activities. One at the beginning of the unit using pizzas to teach my students fractions or parts of the whole and an M&M &M math fraction worksheet and activity at the end of the unit. Where students will have to add the number of M&Ms within the bag and tally the colored M&Ms. Then write the fractions and identify if the M&Ms are greater than, less than, or equal to. In this unit, I will use Howard Gardner's Multiple Intelligences. Using several teaching modalities, I will be able to reach and teach all of my students. Through a combination of interpersonal and intrapersonal activities, I will incorporate linguistic, logical, musical, visual, and kinesthetic modalities. I will also use Bloom's Taxonomy to encourage my students to a higher and greater level of thinking through steps like remember, understand, apply, analyze, evaluate, and create. I will In this unit, I will introduce three different areas of common core state standards. Using math, introducing fractions, English language arts, literacy, focusing on writing, and English language arts and literacy, focusing on speaking and listening.
I will also incorporate technology throughout this unit using standards from the International Society for Technology and Education. The technology I will use throughout this unit are the internet, the smart board using interactive activities, the iPad to record student songs, Pinnacle Studio to create one compilation of all the songs, YouTube, Keynote for my slide presentations, Oh No Math, Pizza Fraction Math, and iXL Math, which can be used in class or at home. At the end of the unit, we will have an introduction to fractions test, where students will have to identify the shaded areas of a fraction, color in the shaded areas of a fraction, identify the numerator and denominator, as well as compare fractions that are greater than, less than, or equal to. By the end of this unit, my students will understand fractions and know that they can have fun with fractions. Now don't forget to keep calm and fraction on. Yay, fractions are fun!